A day after 40 bandits raided Arabal area Baringo County and took off with more than 200 livestock, the government has announced the resumption of a security operation to flush out bandits in Turkana and Baringo counties starting Wednesday. Planned negotiations between area leaders and locals were unsuccessful. Wakati wanaenji wameshawishia kuleta bunduki, unapada viongo zingine pia wanasema kwamba hizo bunduki zikiletwa lazima walipwe. The latest spate of attacks in the last two weeks, claiming a person's life and leading to the loss of livestock. The animals were stolen in Lamaiwe and Muchongoi areas of Baringo, where residents are calling for a change in tact. Roadblocks will be erected and a dusk to dawn curfew imposed. Tutaenda ku target sio Baringo peke yake tunataka kuongeza pia Turkana East na pia kuongeza upande wa upande wa Laikipia In March local leaders and security officers agreed to use a gentle approach in the disarmament process for a period of 30 days through negotiations but Natembea says only three firearms were surrendered in that period Lakini hiyo na kuonyesha kwamba hakuna nia kabisa ya hii watu uh, ku cooperate na viongozi wao bila walikuwa me, wameahidi uh, kwamba watafanya ile serikali si, isitumie uh, nguvu in Kiambu County, residents of Gatundu North are now seeking the intervention of security officers following an upsurge in cattle rustling cases in that area. Eight cattle were reportedly stolen Monday. Ngobe ikieda, hairudi, buzi zikieda, hasirudi. Kwa hivyo sisi tunariria serikali wakati huu. Itusaidie, tuwe, uh, turudisiwe mari yetu, hili tuwedere na maisha. Askari wetu. Walisema wana gari ya, kufu, ya kueda huko kufikia hizo ngombe. Sasa tunaomba tusaindiwe. Kajiado na kaunti ya Kiabu na kaunti ya Narok, wote washikane watatu kukuwe na mkutano, diyo suruhisho lipatikane na suruhisho la kudumu. The residents want the government to establish a police station in the area. Miriam Nyambura, Citizen TV.